What's going on guys? Also Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Marvel Collector Core for this month, which maybe it's last month, but this time the theme is Infinity War. So we got the Infinity Gala going on there. And this is a humongous box as you can see it almost barely fits in the camera. So I don't know exactly what's all in here. But I, since I do think this is their last one, I think, though you never know, they could throw another one in there. Um, I assume they'll go out with a bang, so I'll just have to see, but let's see what it Infinity is. Infinity so Gauntlet! The, oh, there is an Infinity Gauntlet on the lid right there. And of course, we got a bunch of different characters all around there. That's cool. Um, so we did get a big pop that we'll look at last. Um, so I'll go and start with some of the other stuff first. First off, we got some pop... Oh, keycaps. I said pop caps. Keycaps, so they're the pop heads. So we have a Thanos and a Spider Man there. And I assume that you just stick them on, like if you have a plain key or something, they'll stick on there. Of course, they are huge, so if you hope you have a big enough uh, keychain for that, but there are those. So those are something new and different. Um, like I've had one of these before of a Ninja Turtle, but um, this is huge, so I don't know <laughs> what kind of key you put that on. Then next up, oh, we looks like we got another bandana like we did in a Star Wars one a little bit ago. Um, I don't can't oh it looks like it's an Iron Man it does not look like it's a pop thing though it does have the Funko logo if I can figure out how to get this bag open okay so here it is and so yeah there's an Iron Man on there which it's um looks almost looks like Blue Beetle but the Iron Man from the movie if you've seen like I think commercials or toys someone has it where he's got the wings coming off and he's got the weird like uh, fist thing the, of course his new suit forming up around his body and stuff new armor and everything so that's kind of cool it's another bandana it looks almost it's exactly like the one we got from star wars it was red and black where this was like red and dark red um but i don't really care that much about this i don't think they're that cool and next up here it looks like we have a, an infinity gauntlet mug it says heat changing mug so i assume that's what it looks like there so i'll go and take it out of the box okay so we got it out of the box now and so this is not what i was expecting so when i saw the box i thought that's what it was going to look like and it you know would have a hole in the top of it for you to drink out of or something but no it's just a uh, regular mug and then i assume as you put um heater sun i'll kind of put my hands on it to see if it shows up it looks like the infinity stones will show up onto the gauntlet let's see if it show no nothing not hot enough or anything but yeah they'll show up into these black spots i assume um, and it looks like there's also like all the black here will turn into like a space look to it as well. Um, like I said, I thought it'd be a lot cooler, like I said, especially if it was like the fist or something, it'd be really cool. Or if like, you know, it was the sideways fist and then you, so when you drink it, it looks, you know, like you've got your fist in it. But, um, this is not a pop mug and it, it does say Funko, I was going to say, it doesn't even say Funko on it, but on the very bottom it does say Funko. Um, so that's surprised me that's not like, you know, the popish versions that they've been doing. So this is kind of a new thing for that. But um, it's another mug, which we have, you know, tons of mugs, so we don't need another one. But I thought it'd be cool to be the gauntlet. And so our last item in the box is our pop for the month, which again, they are going out with a big bang. And it's a giant Thanos in a uh, ship. Uh, it says the Sanctuary 2 is the ship, which is the Thanos ship we see at the very end of... What, uh, Thor Ragnarok if you saw the end scene or towards the end something the ship pops up in front of the ship that Thor and all the uh, Asgardians are in and stuff and so that's his ship and so we've got Thanos a big Thanos I assume that's supposed to be like the six inch pop and it's of course a pop ride and everything he's got the infinity gauntlet so go ahead and take it out of the box okay so here it is out of the box and you can see all the more or more detail into it so you can see Thanos's head which again I don't like that they don't have his helmet on I like Thanos with the helmet because this way he just looks like an old man to me uh, but you can see the detail of his face they put like scarring and stuff that he's you know been in a fight then of course he has the wrinkled chin because he's got a bunch of chins or something like that um, but then we go into his body and of course he's got this new suit on that he wears in the movie he's got the infinity gauntlet which it does have all of the colors in the gauntlet I don't know if they just did that because you know the infinity gauntlet or or if it's a potential spoiler for the movie, don't know exactly. Um, then we go to a ship, and again, it says Sanctuary 2 is a ship, which I don't really know much about it or anything. Um, but it does look kind of cool. I like the whole two like separated parts going on. And it almost looks like a face. Um, it kind of looks like there's eyes or something. You know, this is like the face. And then back here, it almost looks like hair. So, like, you know, as it's flying, it looks like hair is blowing back. But I assume it's supposed to be, like, smoke and stuff from the engines or something. I don't really know. And then on the bottom, of course, we do have a base. But you can see there are like uh, fans or motors and stuff or something there I assume to help it fly or something don't know exactly but I really like that and I think it looks really cool like it is the movie version I don't like movie version of characters very much I like the comic versions and I wish it was that I still think it's really cool and I'm glad that we got this and there's definitely a good box to go out on if this is their last item and I think that's really cool 
So that's going to be it for this box and possibly the Marvel Collector Core for the rest of our lives. Who knows? They're supposed to be going in stores and stuff, but we don't know where yet. But I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to see more videos. And we will be having our uh, review of the movie coming out on Friday. So if you want to come back to our channel and check that out, you can watch it on Friday to see what our thoughts and opinions were and give us your opinion as well. But do all that for me, and we'll see you next time.